In this tutorial, I'd like to show you how to create a tilt shift look with Depth Blur. Depth Blur is a part of the FX Factory Pro suite of plugins. I'm in After Effects, but this effect works in Final Cut Pro, Final Cut Express, and Motion as well. It's located in FX Factory Pro Blur. I'll drop it on my first clip. I wanted to create a tilt shift effect. This is a look that's popular these days in video and even in feature films. It's often used to simulate a miniature scene with its shallow depth of field and selective focus. Depth Blur makes this easy. First off, I'll choose the tilt shift preset. You can see that the depth mask image changed to a diagonal bar, indicating what's going on here, a masked blur. In this case, the outsides of the picture are blurred. I'll move the sharpness slider up to maximum to decrease the feather on the built-in mask and really see the edges of the blur. You can see the change in the depth mask indicator and also on my clip. Now I'll position the effect how I want it with the center, angle, and width controls. I can easily just grab the crosshairs in the center of the clip to move the center parameter around. Now I'll back down the radius amount, which is the amount of blur. For more info on the parameters and how you could use a custom mask in this effect, click on the FX Factory Pro logo. I like this look, so I'll save it as a preset. This looks cool, but I'd like to have the picture pop a little better. I'll drop a bleach bypass filter from the Fix Color collection and tweak the settings until I blow out the highlights a little bit. As I'd mentioned a minute ago, Tilt Shift is a method to replicate miniatures. I can add to this effect by slightly speeding up my footage. I'll go to the Layer menu, select Time, and choose Time Stretch. I'll set this to 80% to speed it up a bit. Depth Blur is a great FX Factory Pro effect that allows you to easily create a tilt shift look the next time you need one for your footage. FX Factory offers a trial period. This is a great transition to try out. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great plugins, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at noiseindustries.com.